this is the story of two brothers who grew up around here, the town of Murfield in West Yorkshire. Where I'm stood now is the realisation of their dream, the end of a very emotional journey. As we scale the heights above their hometown of Murfield, we get a bird's eye view of their biggest achievement to date, St Paul's Lock Development by the canal. My father was involved in building and from school age, school holidays, we used to, used to go with him and, uh, and, and, and just have, in, enjoy it right from day one, you know, we, we felt it, for, it was for us. Being in the family, generations even going back beyond my father, um, so it were, it's, it's definitely in the blood and yeah, really uh, take great passion in what we do. And I can tell there's a great camaraderie between you two, how, how much has that helped having your kid brother alongside. Oh, it, it's amazing to have a relationship we have as brothers, but then to come to work together and have long hours at work yeah. and go home smiling, no fallouts. And we come across many people who, who sadly, we can't work for them as, as a family in business. We're very fortunate. We've got 30 years under his belt now and, and, and still yeah. and putting away yeah, really yeah. well. You know, it's, yeah. we always say we like the salt and pepper on the table and <laughs> Nigel has his rules, I have my rules and, and, it, and it sort of works, you know, it, 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 it's really good. Just dovetail together really well. We've both got our own strengths and weaknesses but we, we cover each other really well and it just gels. We both pull on the same side of the rope and it, it's, it's great. And as they showed me around these new apartments for the over 55s, there was proof that their achievements have already been recognised by their peers. So you won the national Award, Supreme Award, two years running. Yeah, yeah, that's it. The NHBC Pride in the Job Awards um, and Dream Come True, really. We won the actual Supreme Award in 2017. And then, amazingly, we managed to scoop it again, back so, it up the, the year after, 2018. Nas national so, champions defending yeah. your title. Yes, <laughs> yeah, stuff of dreams, yeah. Oh, yeah, congratulations. Yeah, I'll, I'll, put, I'll put it back in its pride of place. I must say, Darren Smith does things to an incredibly high standard. It's like coming into a four-star hotel, really, or even five-star hotel, and the apartments are, are done very, very beautifully. You know, they're really, really nice. That point of deciding what you want to build on there, and it's really, you know, you're sticking your neck out there. Is it going to work? Are they going to sell? Big, big commitment for a small family company. But you go on the emotional journey then of, of creating it, standing back at the end of the day and actually seeing it. And when people are telling you they actually love being in there and it's their home, that's a lot of job satisfaction. And building developments in their hometown has made it extra special for them. We're both born and bred in Murfield and, and to see that transformation um, is great. We, you know, we just want to see Murfield develop and enhance all the time and, and it's great to be, to be part of that. It's made them well known and respected in their own town too. He talks to people, oh one of Darren's places. He's got that reputation, but you've got that sort of long term feeling about the guy that is going to be there. The brothers have also built their own head offices on Crossley Lane in Murfield, which provides space for local businesses, settling in this rural community in its historical sought after setting. <laughs> And Castle Mount is one of a number of other luxury Darren Smith developments built by the brothers. Perhaps it's because there's no place like home for Darren and Nigel Smith. Tim Murphy. Tim Murphy. Tim Murphy. Tim Murphy. Cheers.